Hi, I'm Lori Handy. I'll be speaking to you today from the Vaccine Education Center at Children's Hospital of Philadelphia. Today we'll be talking about why we give the hepatitis A vaccine to babies. When I'm talking about this vaccine with parents, I'm often asked the question, what even is hepatitis A? Hepatitis is a virus that causes inflammation of the liver. When children get sick with this, that means they will end up having fever, belly pain, nausea, vomiting, and jaundice, which would be yellowing of the eyes, the skin, and darkening of the urine. When we see this infection in children, some will actually have mild symptoms, but every once in a while, we'll even see children end up in the hospital with this. When people think about this virus, sometimes they think about risk factors like international travel. However, we're now seeing more and more outbreaks within the United States. Sometimes we see those outbreaks in groups who might have a risk factor, like individuals who are experiencing homelessness or those who have recently traveled internationally. Sometimes though, we see people who have no risk factors at all. Perhaps they ate a contaminated food, anything from shellfish to raw vegetables to frozen strawberries. Sometimes they ate at a restaurant and they don't even know that they got infected with hepatitis A. This virus is particularly challenging to track exposures to because people may spread the virus up to two weeks before they even know they're sick with it. So it continues to move throughout our communities. In communities where we see low rates of vaccination in children, we continue to see the virus spread. Since we've seen this more and more in the United States, we've moved to this universal recommendation starting at age one. This helps parents know that regardless of an exposure, their child will be protected from hepatitis A infection. Thank you for taking the time to listen today.